I just feel like you could have been nicer to me. Oh my gosh, well I feel like you could have done any more things today than you did. I feel like I woke up and I cleaned our room, I did our bed, I cleaned the sheets, I did the laundry, I put your clothes away, I come in the kitchen, nothing's done. So I do everything, then I make you breakfast, then I get the baby ready, then I get myself ready. And what do you do, Michael? You just tell me I could have been nice. That seems pretty nice to me. And you thought I was pretty nice last night. Better stop complaining, my boy. <laughs> stop complaining. If you're just sitting on the couch not doing nothing, bro, and your woman is running around doing everything, cleaning the house, taking care of the chores, and your ass just sitting down there like King Joffy Joe, keep your mouth shut. Take this from a married man. Just keep your mouth shut. So I have a question, and this one came by request. Fellas, do you like for your woman to have a little twang to her? is what it was referred to as, meaning, do you like your woman to like go through the day and then give you some? Or do you like yours fresh out the shower, fresh off the press? Let me know. I wanna know. So I have a question. Um, Fresh out the shower. Fresh, 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 fresh out the shower. Now, I ain't gonna lie. I can't, I can't, I can't say that. You know what? I can't say that, bro. Because when they have a little twang, you feel what I'm saying? That's when you could, you could smell it on your mustache. Mm. I don't know. I, I, mm. I never thought about that. Sometimes you need some, you you know what I'm saying? When you're having a bad day after you done ate some. I would never have a kid. You don't want a kid? No. Why not? Fuck. Your pussy gets loose, you get bloated, you gain weight. What the fuck? Why would I do that? Ass can concave, your, your, a, your V to your A can rip. What the fuck? I would never have kids. I cannot support them. I cannot send them to school and stop them from dying. Hell no. I would never have kids. I cannot afford their health care. I cannot afford to pay for them. If you do not wrap it up before you put it inside me, f that shit. You're getting sued. I'm having an abortion. I would never have kids. You you wouldn't want a mini you? No. What the f I suck. You suck? Yeah. How much do you suck? I'm selfish as f I care about me. I do not want to have that kid die. What the f Copy of me in the world, they should be blessed. Okay? If I send that to kid to school and then it gets shot up and then they die, what the f The world is not blessed with me. Okay? I cannot have that on my hands. I would never have a kid. Yo. How can you be friends with a person like this? If you saw this video and you her friend, get away. She is a ball of walking negativity. <laughs> hey. <laughs> Cousin turned into Mike Tyson. That's funny. That is hilarious. Cousin turned into Mike Tyson. Talking about Mike Tyson, man. I think I want to get into one of these uh, celebrity boxing matches, bro. I actually know the guy who's one of the promoters for uh, celebrity boxing. He goes to my... Well, I, I ain't signed up at LA Fitness no more, but he goes to the LA Fitness over here. So, I got his number and everything, bro. I think his name is Josh. I believe his name is Josh. So, yeah. We'll see what happens. Who bought, who bought you those shades? These shades? My sugar daddy. Do you have to give them sugar for that? Never be afraid. Never be afraid to ask men in El Paso for money. These men are so ugly, they will always pay up. These shades? This man was wrong. He's going to pay for them. He's going to pay for them, babe. This man is so fine. You better not ask him for money. Hey, my bad, bro. It's the interview, but you got to pay the child. <laughs> Ah! Go 
Go sell your shades. Go sell our shades. Ah! Go sell our shades. How embarrassing, yo. Oh, my God. Pay for her drink. Hey, this nigga. She gotta go back and pay for her drink. Where the Talking all that garbage. I ain't, man. I. I'm done, bro. I, I'm tired of talking about females who just want dudes for money. I'm, I'm tired. I might need a new direction for my channel, bro. Because a lot of these videos are really, really depressing. Would you date someone who's plus size? Who's that? Yeah. No, I don't like that. <laughs> oh, 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 oh. Oh, me personally, I don't like fat girls. You know? Why? 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 I just don't want to come, come home to a fat girl. Okay, why is that? Why is that? Because, uh... <laughs> you can be honest. There's no right or wrong answer. Be honest. I just don't, I just don't like fat girls. I, it's simple. I just don't like them. So me, me personally, I just don't like them. Okay, then what's your type? No, like skinny, I guess. Like, she has to be less than, like, 140, 150. I appreciate the honesty. Yeah, um, I mean, no, no, that's no, okay. No disrespect, you know, I just don't. Be, be personal. No disrespect, and why just say fat bitch? I don't know. <laughs> you gonna say that's not my time. Oh, okay, my bad. I'm sorry. But what is it, what is it though about the quote unquote fat that you don't mind? I, I don't know, I just. There has to be a reason. Or multiple reasons. I just don't like it, I don't know. What is Petite it? only, it's just perfect. Okay, what, what's your preference? Petite. Would you date someone who's plus? Yo, the crazy thing is that she's plus size, but like, if she was to lose weight, she would be fine as fuck. Like, she's pretty as hell, and you can tell that she has a nice shape. If she was to lose, if she was to go to the gym for three months, she'll be bad. The thing I don't like about videos like this is, it's literally people who refuse to take responsibility for themselves. And their health are sitting around here saying, oh, I don't like when people fat shame me. Stop stop body shaming. But to me, body shaming would be something that you can't change. For example, I'm 5'6". I can't change being 5'6". I mean, well, I can. I can freaking go get my legs lengthened. But I'm pretty sure my mobility is not going to be the same. So, no, I can't change being 5'6". But if you're fat... You can go on a diet. You can work out. You can change that. You feel me? That's not body shaming. That's not body shaming. Body shaming will be, oh, she got a flat butt. And you just, oh, pancake booty. You know what I'm saying? You call her all... <laughs> you call her all types of name in the book because she has a flat butt. That's body shaming. But if you're fat because... You want to go take a midnight snack at one in the morning and just be in the fridge like a damn roach. That's on you. That's not body shaming. That's just me telling you, you need to take responsibility for yourself. I mean, I, I ain't going to lie. I'm chubby too, but I've been working out. Uh -huh. That's why, well, we need him to step down. We need him to... Uh... Go ahead and uh, he has to be fired. Now, I know you thought we probably wouldn't be back, but we're going to keep coming back. Uh, he spit at a black man. He pulled a knife on him. All right? Yeah, you. Yeah, you. Yeah, yeah, we know you did it. We got you on tape. We got you on tape doing it. You're not going to keep having a business in this community, stealing from our people, disrespecting our people. Yeah, there you go. Call the police. You had that same phone last time, so I know it's you. You're not going to keep disrespecting our people. You're not going to have a business in this community and not lose money. I know you can shake your head. I understand. No, I just, like, I'm not shaking it because it hurts me personally. I bet. It hurts us. It's because not my job, I'm not being disrespectful. Oh, no, no, no. But this is the thing. The man just wanted his pizza remade and because you touched it with your hands and you wouldn't give him your money and his money back. Then... <laughs> You spit at the man and pull the knife on him. So I'm going to say this with all respect to everybody. Mm -hmm. I'm marrying a black man. I am not racist. I love everybody that's standing right here. We're going to go to court and tell them I am going to speak my, I'm going to say my part again. Okay. hope that y'all can see all the time. Right. But while we're still here, we're not going to stop. 
Well, we had slave masters that, that raped slaves and married slaves. <laughs> All due respect, you know, this is not me. I, 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 I'm I, married a black man and this, that, and the third. My boy listened to that and said, well, we all had uh, slave masters that loved their slaves and married slaves. <clears throat> Yo! All that you personally, yeah, that's me. You personally love that one black man. I don't know if you love the rest of us, but the whole case is... Damn. Damn. You're gonna definitely get money if he's not bought it. I'm telling you, we're gonna come back here and we're gonna shut this place the hell down unless he's let go. Because you can't spit at somebody or pull knives on somebody just because they want their money back. You understand mm. me? No justice! No peace! No justice! No peace! No justice! No peace! No justice! No peace! Fall out! And we will be back! Hey, I'm not a big fan of protesting, but protesting like that, that's cool. You know, you stopping the particular business that offended a brother from making money. And that's, that's, that's protesting. You know? Yeah, I can agree with that. I can agree with that. All that other sitting in on the highway, you know, uh, yeah, I, ain't, I I can't get down with that. Sitting on the highway and shit like that, throwing paint on, on people's fur coats, I ain't with none of that. Anyway, ladies and gentlemen, this is today's video. I hope that you made it all the way to the end, you know. Uh, if you made it to the end, make sure you hit that subscribe button and make sure you hit that notification bell because without that notification bell, you are relinquishing control to the YouTube algorithm and the YouTube algorithm do not play fair sometimes. All right. You hit that notification bell after you subscribe. That means that every time I upload a video, boom. Well, it don't sound like that. Go ding you get a notification and you'll be able to watch it. Capiche?